he was supposed to, they're supposed to be attacking me okay <laughs>
which is annoying. It still does that for Cam through Camtasia, which is the program I use, and um, with the HD thing, it's one point something gigabytes when I do a follow video for some reason, and also Minecraft it used to do uh, for a 25 minute video, but um, if I can compress and it's like 800, maybe 750 or something, I'm happy with that. And I'm sorry, I'm getting a message from Windows here, so I'm going to be right back. Sorry, it wasn't Windows, it was actually Java trying to uh, do something on my computer, but uh, I said no because I don't like you. Hello. Right, um, you're probably wondering why have I just started talking about a load of crap and just walked right here. Well, as you saw at the Gunrunners Arsenal, not the Gunrunners Arsenal, the Gunrunners, we had quite a low sum of money and we want to get into the strip so we can get more money by other ways i.e. gambling and also to continue on the story because um spoiler alert that's where we first get invited to uh, meet kaiser himself the leader of kaiser's legion of course um so we're gonna have to do that at some point if we want to carry on this legion orientated playthrough and uh, I'm just jumping around here, but we need at least 1,000 caps to get into the strip, so we need to do some jobs. Hello. Welcome to the Silver Rush. Uh, Afraid I'm gonna have to search. Uh, go for it. Search away. Should Don't care what you're talking about. There. I've stole all of yep. Cool. Let me in. Right. There's a thing up here, but it's pretty boring. But I'm not. I, I might skip it. I might not. But um. You'll have to wait until it's over. Mr. Soren, please get to the point. The second half of your payment is late, and I want to know why. Miss Van Graff, my associates and I have decided that we wish to renegotiate the terms of our deal. Might I ask for what reason? The shipment was delivered. The guns were tested before leaving this facility. Regardless, we feel that the quality of the weapons is below expectation, and hope to adjust the price accordingly. Ah. I think I understand what the issue here is. Excuse me for a moment, would you? Do it. Never break faith with the Van Graffs, Mr. Soren. I expect you'll have the rest of our payment ready tomorrow morning. And he runs off okay, like a everyone. little girl. Show's over. Back to work. Right, so this is a place where I believe we can... How can we do this again? Uh, give me a second. Sorry, I keep on just leaving you guys, and I'm sorry about that. It's just I'm trying to get my buttons because it's been a while. But um, because we're loaning money at the moment, I'm just going to steal some shiz from the Van Graffs, which is fairly simple. It's never been patched. And I think it was actually just part of the game. If you take this over here, I'm just gonna drop these down here, put them in here, and I failed completely. Well, not actually. Just shove them in there. I'm not sure if you get bad karma, you might. But they can't see you. See, hidden. Bam, bam. Now you've got them in your inventory. Hello. And then you can sell it back to them. And uh, you'll have money. And you can also pick up a gun to use it for yourself because I believe they are um, in quite good condition. Yes. And also, if you ever decide to you want to kill the Van Graffs, I don't know if there, I don't think there is a mission. I've not completed every mission in Fallout New Vegas in my lifetime yet. But I have done Fallout 3, but um, I don't know if there's a mission to like hunt the Van Graffs down because there is some people who do not like the Van Graffs. Welcome to the Silver Hello. Rush, where only top of the line energy weapons can be found. What can I do for you? Um, but, but uh, you got any work available? It just so happens a position opened That's up good. recently. We currently need another body to guard the entrance outside. Think you can handle that? Yeah, I can handle that. Sure, count me in. One. He's been with the family for years, so listen to what he says and follow his instructions. I shall. Also, I am some good news. Apart from the bad news that um, I was saying about the. Gigabyte. No, I don't know if I've told you guys already, but I've got a pop filter now in my microphone. 
and I personally think I sound a lot better. I sound a lot clearer and I don't pop quite so often um, when I'm talking. I do have to speak a little tiny, tiny bit louder, but that's absolutely fine for me when um, I've not got anyone in the house. Alright, hello, Simon. Welcome to the Sylv. Ah, oh, crap. Don't tell me you're my new guard. Hell yeah, that's right, I'm your new guard. Well, no time for pleasantries. I've got your gear right here, but let's see if you can follow instructions. You'll be covering the other side of the yep. door there. Take your position while I get your stuff out. Okay. Good. Look around and get a feel for where customers and risks can enter and exit the area while I get your gear ready. Okay, now let's get you geared up. First, your armor. Standard issue is your run-of-the-mill combat armor, with a nice dark coat of paint for both brand recognition and sheer intimidation value. Next, your weapon. Guards are required to use rifles. Anything lighter compromises your combat effectiveness. Anything heavier and people are too scared to come in the door. What's your preference? Laser or plasma? I like a good bit of plasma in my arms. Nothing wrong with going plasma. Just make sure you hit what you're aiming at. Now that you're equipped, a quick word on the job at hand. In a nutshell, we're here to keep the riffraff away. Drunks, punks, and capless vermin are to be turned away. Potential customers are to be permitted normal entrance. That is, after we pat them down for weapons. An unarmed man is a lot less likely to try to steal something with several armed guards around. Don't start any fights. I don't care if some jet junkie just insulted your mother. We're here to promote violence elsewhere, not start it here. Lastly, don't abandon your post. We're getting paid to stand next to this door, not talk to someone down the street or head to the casino. That goes double for any thoughts of splitting with that gear. Every now and then, some young punk thinks he can run off with Van Graaff property. Trust me, the rifle and armor are nice, but they're not worth your life. Other than that, relax. There's usually some eye candy coming and going from the Wrangler over there at some point, so the view's not too bad. Yes, sir. I could disagree about the view being, um... A little pleasant. I mean, in the Atomic Wrangler, there's a big, you know, window with uh, a lot of um, glass um, missing. And it's not exactly the nicest of places, but yeah, sure, pleasant view. Eye candy. Whoa. And trust me, I've seen the women on the strip. It's not pleasant. Hi is this where I can pick up a laser gun? Sure. But I can't let you in. Company policy. Sounds like a stupid policy to me. Yep. Good. It sure Stick is. Rules. I should probably pull up my gun. Another one coming. Pew. You're up. I, I think I'm doing all the work here. He's not doing anything. Is he yeah, he's coming from this way. He is a clean guy. He can uh, do. Um, he can come in, I think. Uh, hi. I was uh, in the area and thought I'd stop by to look at your weapons. Can I go in? I'm gonna have to search you first. Fine by me. He's clean. Get in there and Not buy all the shit. Heads up. Looks like we got another customer. Right, um I don't think he can get in. Just looking at him, I don't think he's the right sort of guy. I'm not sure he'll start a fight. But uh I I think he he walk away, but I don't think he's sorry guy. Howdy! I just done broke the bank over at the Wrangler there and thought I might peruse your fine wares. Maybe lighten my purse a little? Uh, certainly, we need to pat you down for your weapon first. Now, hold on here. I'm not packing any heat. Ain't my word good enough for you? It should be fine. Go in. See, I've never done that, so let's see. Huh, that's better. 
We're supposed to pat everyone down. Didn't you hear that part of my instructions? Yes, but I can I could just say no. And um you could have pat him down. Don't screw it up. Yeah, he's got a gun. Just the look in his eyes. Cause I can definitely see him from here. But uh yeah. I think he's got a gun. I think he's gonna try and kill us. Is it us? I don't know. He just looks doesn't look right. Alright. Hello? Hey, looking for something to replace my old revolver. Mind if I head in? Um yeah, but we're gonna have to uh, search you first. That's not really necessary, is it? I already told you I got this here revolver, right? Why do you have some died? You're gonna ask me questions all day, or are you gonna let me in? I'll keep asking. Oh, you still. I don't know. I'll keep asking until you answered. Damn, I. Boom. Headshot. Yeah. Revenge note. That's what it is. That was about. Crap. This I do not need today. Keep your head straight, Rookie. Things are about to get interesting. I hate you, Pacer. I really, really do. Looks like you've got a little helper today. What can I say? Business has been good lately. Can afford to help. Good to hear, buddy. So is the boss lady in? You know she is. Why don't you go in and say hi? Nah, I got some rounds to run. But do pass along that I'm always thinking of her. Actually, I got a better idea. Make the new hire tell her. You'll do that for me, won't you? You've got a really punchable face. Why don't you tell it yourself? Tell her yourself, sorry. I would, but I tend to distract the boss lady a little too much. She can't help herself. Anyway, I got things to do. Later, Simon. Way to keep your head, rookie. Let's hope for you yet. I take it she is into, uh... It's just about closing time. Marshals? Let's go see the boss about getting paid. Oh, I'm gonna need the rifle and armor back. Boss's orders. Alright, um, let's go. Get paid, bitch. You got a problem. Oh great. Alright, um let's put something on. Oh yeah, we should probably sell that shiz. I always get the wrong bloody button. No, I don't want to do bloody console commands. Simon's been telling me how it went. You had a little bit of a hard time following instructions, but didn't do too bad overall. Here's your pay. Unfortunately, I found someone else with a little more experience, and he'll take over the position starting tomorrow. However, another task has come up that I could use some help with, assuming you're still interested in making some money. I'm always. Keep talking. There's a deal that we've been working on for a while now, and the buyer would like a sample of our weapons. I need you to run a package out to a discreet location that the client has chosen. Sound good? I'll do it. Good. Here's the package. I'll mark the location on your map. The buyer said they'd be in town for quite a while, so there's no rush. That said, try not to dawdle. This client could mean big money for us, which naturally means big money for you. Right. That's good. Oh yeah, I should probably... Welcome back. Did you have news for me, or are you just here? I'd like to see what you of have course. for sale and peruse your wares. Let's see, do I- Oh, I've got a laser rifle! 
Bam. Bam. Oh. Let's take this one back. And, um, accept. We're nearly there already. As simple as that. Right, so, um, we can, uh, exit. And we're still. Welcome back. Did you. Of course. Let's have a nice little sale of the leather armor. You can go. Yeah. No, no, no. Accept. Right. So, ladies and gentlemen, I am still over encumbered. Screw it. Let's just slowly walk out. So we're going to next episode. Uh, this episode is coming to an end now. Next episode, we will do some more jobs for our good old Gloria and help her out with this buyer. Also, if we have time, I might uh, see if the Atomic Wrangler has any work in store. So, um, without further ado, I want to thank you very much for watching. I could open this up if I had a better lock picking skill. But um, thanks for watching. Please drop a like, drop a comment, and subscribe if you've not done so already. My name is Stally111, Stally111, and I hope you've enjoyed yourself. Thanks for watching. Peace off, and see you next episode. Bye.